thought I'd share this story with viewers, but after the show on Friday, Jackie came up to me and asked me why we kept saying white nationalist instead of white supremacists when talking about Richard Spencer and the protesters in Charlottesville. And to be honest, I think we just took the lead from the New York Times in all the networks, Fox News and MSNBC calling them white nationalists, but it really bothered us. Like, why are we watering down what we're calling these people? The main reason is because that's now what they're calling themselves, white nationalists. But after a quick Google search, I realized that the new name has all been totally stage managed for our benefit. Ever heard of a euphemism? Well, Merriam-Webster defines it as a word or expression substituted for another considered too harsh when referring to something unpleasant. Sound familiar? They're used all the time in modern language to basically temper how something sounds. Think internment camps versus concentration camps, or nationalism versus terrorism, or how about this one? Sexual assault versus rape. Doesn't sound as bad, right? Terrorists versus insurgents. Well, I even saw one article where white supremacists called themselves racial realists, which doesn't sound that bad. I don't know what it is, but it doesn't sound that offensive. And how about their brand new wardrobes? Gone are the Klan robes and the, the white hoods, and now it's all golf shirts and khakis. Nothing offensive about that, right? Again, all stage managed to uh, dazzle us and woo us and make themselves seem a lot less radical and more like the rest of us.